The main objective of the formation is just to improve the farmer's life, but that to bring them uh, out of poverty. When you see is a people who are bringing this product, coffee, to this world, especially coffees which we are drinking now. The coffee is from the Gachaf area and the Harar, their life looks like this. They live in houses made of hatches and uh, they don't have uh, sanitation issues, no clean water. And they lack uh, social needs like uh, good housing, water, food, sanitation problems. And uh, they don't have access to uh, community uh, facilities like school, clinic, health, education, family planning. So, uh, as you can see, they have many kids. Uh, and also, they don't have knowledge on modern farm system to increase their productivity and also good agriculture and the they don't have diversification. So and, uh, no credit to individual farmers because their land is very small. And they don't have information also to, to coffee for when to sell and uh, for that price. And that's the reason why uh, we don't have vehicles, small vehicles at home. The roads are not good. So this makes these people the poorest the poorest of all. And when we measure the country again, people who do have water like this are about 22%. And uh, about 78% of the people do not have clean water. And 88% of the people live on uh, farming. People who read and write are 41.5%. And nearly 90% live with less than $2 a day. And uh, the average yearly income is $97. So this makes the country one of the poorest countries in the world. So to tackle these problems, the only way to just uh, come out of poverty is just to get organized on what they do have. What they have is they have coffee growers or be it a grain growers. The only alternative for these farmers is to get organized, assemble their produce and uh, try to link them into the market. This was what I wanted to make it happen. And uh, in the country, you know, what we did was we restructured, uh, we formed a new cooperative proclamation with the government, uh, mainly at the beginning at the regional level. And then we took it to the federal level. And now we have about 33,636 primary societies or cooperatives on different activities with more than 5.6 million people. Just trying to bring them, to link them to the market and come out of poverty. So we, since after forming these primary societies, the problem we had was that they, they are not economically uh, viable. They don't have money. So what we did was we brought them into cooperative unions so that they can export their produce or market their produce within the country. So we do have now about 200, 212 cooperative unions uh, in the country, which are working on grain marketing cooperatives, saving credit, coffee cooperatives, and the vegetable uh, and fruit marketing cooperative, livestock marketing cooperative. All together, these cooperative unions are uh, just have given opportunity for 57,441 uh, people to get a job. Mm -hmm. And also, at the union level, they have got the possibility of bringing 2,955 people to, to get jobs. So it is based on uh, this uh, formation of the union that I represent one of the biggest cooperative, coffee farmers cooperative union, which is bringing coffee uh, to this country. And, uh, I am the founder of this union and also the general manager. And I'm also behind the cooperative law of the country working with the government. And now we are operating in all of Romia region, which is the central, southern, eastern part of the country. And the green shaded parts are all coffee growing districts. 